All right, last episode of Crab Champions, we unfortunately did not have a very good ending to the burst pistol attempt. Uh, we're going to try it again. Like I said last time, this game, this gun is pretty good. It's pretty fast. And we got the exact same mod. Okay, well, it's almost like it's feeling bad for me. So maybe we try to make this one work this time. I think we can do it. Just start off nice and slow. Just let them go through the fire real quick. Should just melt everything away. So, what did we learn from the last run? I think that we learned that triple shot is not going to do it. You know, it's going to be okay, but it's not going to be enough. Uh, we go for F every fifth shot, I think. Early econ probably would have been good. I think we just need to go for, like, uh, maybe some reload speed or some... Some attack speed, though. I think skill lets you get some attack speed in certain ways. I'm honestly not sure. It's probably going to give me, like, spread. Which, honestly, I could take spread reduction. It's been a day or so since I recorded the other burst pistol, but... It's always fun to jump back on this game and uh, get humbled real quick. Portal ring. Extra extra choice is probably really good. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. So we get lots of choices. Hopefully more, more parkours. It's a free epic chest. Just do this real quick. Oh, hello. Perfect. Yeah, more choices is great because a lot of the times we just don't get a good option. Now we have three options to choose from and there's two. Are you serious? Okay, well, this is good. I... I think we go for trick shot for just the guaranteed damage increase. And I, I, even though we got two options for elite, I'm going to go for the damage. Oh, can you get through this crack? Okay, we can. So can they. Perfect. I love how the stage always has that big crystal. It's just, it's just free money. There we go. Give me that money. A couple more, no? Oh, there's one up there. Good enough. Let's go. Steady shot. I guess we just go more trick shot. I mean, ultra shot's decent, but, like, the bullet is kind of slow. Uh, Random. Let's go for spiked, actually. I'm feeling spicy today. Okay, decent damage to start. 12 damage on each bullet. Not bad. Uh, yeah, I'm still worried about like loop two though. Or like loop, I guess loop one. Is it considered loop one? Is this loop one or loop zero? I, I'm not even called a loop, I guess. I don't know what's, what I'm saying. Anyway, the first loop. I'm scared of the first loop. Spike chest, we open. I think we go big chest here. We need more options. I made sure to look at the ground there too because we know how how you can sometimes select the the stage instead of the item in the chest. I mean, it might have been fixed by now, but I just want to avoid that chance. No, dude, not you again. We have an angered minigun. Two snipers. That's one down. I'm just keeping my distance. I hate sniper crabs with a passion. We have another one. I 
screen. Can you not? Okay. I think I can probably place this down right there and that should do it. What's left? Oh, just an ant. All right. Not bad. Bit of a long stage. We got poison again. I'm going to try the arcane shot this time. Let's go for it. All right, onto the shop. We got the arcane shot. You know, it can it can do pretty well. I would say that poison's still stronger. But assassin, that's not going to happen. We'll go for uppercut here. And then if we see anything good, we may it's an early checklist, but I don't think we throw things away for it. Uh, it's tough. Okay, well. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, let's see how the arcane does here. Okay, so so far the damage isn't great. And the chance for the arcane to go off is not high. <laughs> Just deal with the boss. We don't really care about the uh, the pumpkins or the, the slugs because if the grubs are just dead, the main boss is dead, then they all just disappear anyway. So let's just do that. Yeah, arcane is okay. It's definitely the second best elemental. It's definitely juiced here. And we increase our HP. Okay. Juice is a great start. The faster we can attack, the more stacks we do. Usually when I focus on elemental builds, I'm really just focusing on how much output of the stacks of elemental I can do. So the attack speed is more so just, just for getting those stacks out there. And when they did have the lucky charm, I would just stack that to get more procs. go streak shot is equalizer really what I'm gonna be doing here I mean it works right now I guess I'll do <laughs> I think I just sell I guess it doesn't hurt to have this instead but I don't really want to like get an upgrade for it okay well let's see what we get Send them down. Okay, we're actually doing decent damage. Goodbye. Juiced again. Yes, we take juiced. Okay. We could probably deal with an elite. So I'm going to take the elite for the free... Uh, for the free epic. Uh-oh. 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 Hold up. Okay, this isn't free. Oh god, okay. Oh god. Oh god, the barrels. Oh no, <laughs> please. I'm gonna die. Okay, that was actually kind of sketchy. That is my fault. Okay, big hearts is good. Damage shot. Ooh, okay, wait, damage shot won't be that good actually because the damage is so low on the weapon. So I think we go for arc shot. Yeah, and we go for s maybe an upgrade here. We need HP.
Yeah, we go for HP here if we can. And then we uh we build on to like split shot if possible. Yeah, we're already seeing the effect of arc shot, it's just hitting everything in the room. <laughs> so that's pretty nice. I say our shot is definitely better for like rocket launcher and stuff like that, but it's still very effective. There we go. Once you get a couple stacks of arcane, we're good to go. Okay, what do we got? Juiced again. I think we do that. Even though, like, yes, I would love to upgrade my arcane shot. I think getting juice, like, up, like, really crazy right now is definitely going to be more valuable. Because it's harder to find. Oh, God. Okay, sketchy, 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 sketchy. Somehow that laser skull died. I'm not sure how he died. But he did. I'm not going to complain. Ooh, I think we go just for extra HP. But 75% of my HP is probably more valuable right now. I think we do this to be safe. We go for... Just a luck chest, maybe. Okay. Hello, minigun crab. How are you doing? Ooh, please. I don't feel good about this run right now. Like the 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 the, the attack speed is great, but this will fall off very quickly. Okay, luck chest for rig totems. We have a shop. What do we have here? Big hearts. What's arc shot looking like? Thirteen percent chance. Sure. Let's go for more. Big hearts could be good, but I don't really want to get rid of anything. Yeah, we just run this. Just going to go up here real quick. I should clear them out in a second. Okay. Yeah, I honestly don't care about like aiming, but like lets me float for a little bit, which is good. I always forget about that effect that you can actually float for a little bit when you aim. Uh we'll get some bronze heart. Incoming damage re reduced. Oh, I think we go for this is really good. I'm gonna do that. Relics are kinda hard to come by. Oh my. Uh, things are happening. I still don't know if these like these thorns actually hurt you as well. Okay. Yeah, arc shot increase was definitely a good idea. 
Uh, equalizer is working right now, so let's grab it. Go for a flawless damage. Why are there so many enemies? Yeah, okay, so this is actually a funny thing because, like, the arc shot's not, like, super easy to aim, but if you just aim in the general direction, like, you will hit a lot more, and that was a big problem of the last round. We didn't have a lot of wave clear, but this time is a lot better. Um, this could be good. Wind up could be good if we, like, get a way to, like, infinitely shoot. And I'll do uppercut again. I don't know if that counts for every fifth shot or every fifth set of triple shot. Oh, hello, Scorpion. Okay, Scorpions are actually kind of crazy. I, I've only seen a couple, but they're always very scary when I run into them. Okay, wait. We want to do, like, chance to gain ammo, I think. This is insane. Why are there so many crabs? Okay, I think we flawless that. Not that it matters. What is this? A gold. Oof! I don't think it's worth it. It's a little scary. <laughs> Losing two thirds of my HP. Well, I don't really have a great way of... Yeah, I don't really have a great way of keeping myself alive. I will say Arcane is a close second for me for the elementals because you don't need to actually hit enemies after you hit them at the start, if that makes sense. If you get some stacks of Arcane, they're already going to be taking damage. Meanwhile, with Poison, you have to damage them after you hit them a couple times. So in that way, it technically is a better mod or better enhancement. But it's only really good if you can get like a lot of stacks of uh, Arcane. Or maybe get like a bunch of, bunch of potent magic and um, makes so you only have to hit like once and then you do like 500 stacks. Red Fury could be good here. Speedy enemies and elemental explosions. We know that speedy is pretty scary, but we're going to do it. Oh, I'm gonna try to avoid this guy. Please. Thank you. Other one spawned. That's fine though. And there we go. We have double elemental. We have lightning aura. Potent magic for sure. Let's go for more arcane just so we can get guaranteed. Yeah, we're only at 20% chance right now. Definitely bring that up a little bit. Go for the fuse. Danger close, why not? Red Fury again? Mm, I don't think so. Sharp shot's good. We'll take rig totems. Potent magic. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wind up is whatever. I don't think it's super important. It could be though. We're getting good stacks already of arcane. You can see with the split shot happening so often. I think it'll be helpful. Where's the boss at? All right, with 500, 600 stacks almost, should be well, well on our way here. There we go. You know, after this run, I'm starting to think this might actually be the best elemental. I could be convinced. I really thought poison used to be the best. I'm starting to think and maybe my run's just very good, but I, I think that arcane could be in the running for the best. I've kind of flip flop between the two. Naive little me used to think that fire was amazing. I really think the fire is underwhelming. It's basically a worse arcane. I think to make fire more worth it and more in like a more interesting kind of thing is to have like a big fire aura around the enemy that got covered in fire so it burns other enemies with it. Because then I'd be like, okay, you know, I could understand it not doing as much damage if it's doing that damage around other enemies as well. And like at a decent size too. And maybe, and maybe what you could do is make it so that the fire stacks increase the radius of the fire that could get stupid really fast but i think that's kind of an entertaining and fun that would that would actually make me like swing towards like maybe going for fire builds instead but right now as i see it like i don't see any reason why i would choose fire over like even lightning shot like lightning shot is interesting i could probably grab this go for parkour here This is a pretty pretty fast uh, first loop, or first first set of level. I don't I don't know. Always skipping through the uh, the parkour as usual. Assassin. Go for a damage aura here. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to read this equalizer thing. I... It doesn't... Okay, so it says even. Like, it doesn't mean it's equal to each other. It means that they're actually both even. So we need one of each. Greed chest could be really good here. If it's a good greed. Gonna go up here real quick. There we go. Give me something good. Big bones. Max health and da damage increase, but you grow larger. Is there anything? Is there any reason to be? Is, is that a bad thing? I think I like to grab that just because I want to see how stupidly big you can get. I don't feel like I got that much bigger. 10% larger. We go for double relic. If I like got an upgrade chest and then I literally like removed all of my items, could I just guarantee I get the 
Oh god, the lightning shot is going crazy. Can I just guarantee that I get the uh, <laughs> the bigger bones? I guess I could. I don't know if you can get. I don't know if you can get those at a at a greed chest or a upgrade chest. Just trying to keep my distance. This, the launcher crab did quite a lot of damage, actually, so I'd rather just not be near him. Fully heal when entering shops. Pairings, whatever. I guess we could get this. This is kind of whatever. Fully heal when entering shops, I guess. Five more goods for sale could be good. Yeah, I'll do that. Honestly, none of them are really that good. Demolition, though. Should be a pretty quick clear here. I love the nest levels. Like as long as you can clear the the nest pretty quickly, it just goes by so quick. Okay, I think I go. We have fully heal, right? Yeah, fully heal when entering shops. So what we do here is we just grab big hearts. I think. Lots of options. We got damage aura, which I actually forgot we have. <laughs> Lightning ring. Lightning strength increased by 250%, but no poison. But poison no longer has any effect. But we don't have poison. So I think we have, like, more strength. Lightning shot is only 5% chance. I think we do that. Let's try that. Yeah, let's, let's give that a go. Spark shots, whatever. Lightning Aura. Okay, hold up. 5,000. This is whatever. We can definitely like do better than that. I'm starting to think wind up might not be worth keeping. Let me get rid of Equalizer too. We need just a little more. This Portal Ring's good. Reduce damage by 40%. Wait. What the heck? Why is it saying in incoming damage reduced by 50% and then it says reduced by 40%? I think we get rid of this fully heal when entering shops situation. And we buy a damage. Meant to buy the lightning aura. What am I doing? I saw the upgrade number and I went, yep, that's what I'm grabbing. Okay, well. <laughs> whatever. I'm just going to uh, keep my distance. So the thing with these bosses, they can actually refresh your your elemental abilities, which makes it annoying because you can't really stack like heavy heavy elementals. Should be alright though. So I'll be a little careful. Okay. Come on. There we go. 
Easy does it. All right, first loop is always never really a problem for me. But this new and new and improved loop two. This is where things get interesting. Let's see what we get. Level up every third island. So we're going to get 10 extra level ups. That could be good. This is not a triangle shot of my bullets, by the way. This is actually like a, a shot that's like looks like a triangle. I think we do level up. Because none of those none of those are really that good. Okay, our max health was increased by 750 from that. Is it glass? It is. It's a grenade mod though. Well, it's better than nothing, I guess. I always forget how good lightning is too. It's actually underrated. It's probably my most underappreciated elemental. It's really good for clearing. It also works underwater. Which fire and poison does not. And that's actually a good thing about arcane. Actually just that in itself, I think that brings arcane to the best mod for elementals just because it can go underwater and obviously water is only important on the first few maps but still something to consider Can i go for a trick shot here i hate one shot i think it's so scary i mean we would never have an issue probably with like having damage aura and stuff but you never know like why risk it There's no reason to risk my entire run over like one extra item. This should give us the mod upgrade, I think, or maybe one more one more stage. Nice, okay. It's gonna be the next stage, I guess. Wind up. We could do wind up again. It's gonna be up 4%. Although, like, sharp shot is just better damage. But this is f more fun. So then I'm gonna do that instead. I go for luck again. Hopefully, we get, like, another efficiency. And I want all you can eat. Maybe we can get all, get all you can eat from this. We're doing a decent job of clearing waves now, too. It's definitely something I couldn't say about the last run. Spiral grenade got upgraded. I should get rid of that, man. What am I doing? <laughs> oh, it's so stupid. Okay, what is this? No, I don't care about that. Chance to instantly reload after elimination. This could be good. I think we just do chance to gain ammo, though, because it's going to be crazy fast. Flawless luck chest. We just need to kill nests. Why are the nests so hefty on round two? What? There's one down.
Another one down. Oh my god. How am I not getting hit yet? I don't understand. How am I not getting hit? What is happening? Okay, we're good. Efficiency again? Efficiency again? Maybe we grab another... Well, maybe we grab like an auto loader now. Uh, what's efficiency at? 49% chance to gain ammo? Yeah, and then we do a uh, chance to gain full ammo after elimination, which is what chance? 10%. Okay. Go for luck. Still using way too much ammo. It's gonna be impossible. We need we need like all you can eat. We're stacking like arcing like crazy and there's still enemies are not dying. Oh my god, he has like eight hundred like six hundred stacks. Die! Auto loader again? We can get like 100% chance when enemies die? Like, that could be crazy. Yeah, it's already 20% chance. So go for random here. Because yeah, now we just go crazy, right? With wind up. I can't tell if it's actually getting that much faster though. Okay, our damage has definitely fallen off, as you can see, it's pretty bad. Please. We just need to focus our stacks on one enemy. Because they keep clearing, they keep actually keep clearing the stacks. There we go. One more. Goodbye. We got arc shot increase. Okay, that's actually really good. Arcane shot. I think we do that. What are we looking for here? Arc shot, upgrade, split shot is definitely what we need. Yeah, that's going to be huge. All you can eat. Here's all you can eat. Okay. Yeah. And then arc shot. I don't know if we can get that. I don't think we can upgrade it, unfortunately. That sucks. I would have liked to, but is what it is. I'm stuck on. I'm on fire constantly, man.
You keep the stacks up. I think you should just focus on one and get the stacks really high on them. It's kind of hard to do that though. They keep moving. Oh, my health is burning so fast. They're only evenly going down. It's kind of crazy. They also set themselves on fire somehow. Okay, I need more potent magic. That is definitely evident. Let me throw that out. Something good, please. Bonus crystals. It's not good enough, but... It it's like I'm going to do a uh, block incoming damage, I think. And we get... Increase health by 375. foundation is there but we just don't have everything we want can't tell if wind up is even working I think it is. Are we at max speed for this gun? We might be. Nice little heal. That has a huge health increase too. Maybe because of all the juices, we're already like at near max max speed. Just go Red Fury here. Oh, Elemental would be so smart. <laughs> it would be smart, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, we have to do it. Greed is good, but like... I don't know. It's so risky. Especially when we're really hurting for like damage. Like realistically, looking at all of the uh, greed perks, you're looking at maybe like... Two out of the 12 or whatever number it is are really good enough to pick up. Lightning shot being upgraded is actually huge. It should be 10% now. Yeah. Okay. So. Arcane shot. We're sitting at 38% chance. I think with how many bullets we're shooting, it makes more sense to get the percentage up rather than the number you get per one hit. Maybe that's me thinking wrong. I'm probably wrong on that. I feel like that makes sense to me. Also, increasing that to 10% chance on the lightning shot is crazy. Yeah, it's an insane change. Just from one extra lightning shot. We get rapid fire. I think we're already like pretty much at like max speed. I don't understand. Like it's not going much faster. Flawless demolition. Yes, please. Oh, 
Why these things have so much HP? I'm just gonna keep doing my rounds. Nest. Okay, we got flawless somehow. Don't ask me how. Sharp shot. Yep. And red fury. One hit is not worth it. We could try for the hundred enemies. I highly doubt it. Maybe, maybe we can. Yeah, I think we can. Ow. We got it. We got juice. I think we got it. No, we didn't do it. Dang it. We got juice upgrade, though. Yeah, I think we're like a max at this point. How much more damage does, does the fifth shot do? 60 more damage. That's pretty good. Go for elemental. We get another arcane here. Oh my god. Why are there so many of these things? Stop. No, but, but why are there so many? Okay, why are they deciding to go insane on this level? I don't understand what's happening. They keep sniping me. These things need to die. Holy, I lost so much HP on that level. We have, luckily have a shot, but like, holy, that was not fun. High voltage. Now we do arcane sh uh, shot for sure. It's still our main source of damage. We need a heart. Sure. We'll take the silver heart. Banana, arcane shots. Yeah, I think we just go with this. It's pretty good. We just hard stack arcane on one guy here. Why do these guys have so much HP? What is happening? I hope one of them falls off, please. There goes the one. There goes the there goes the boss. Thank you. Just this guy left. 
Okay, bosses are not that easy. We only have two more bosses to really go through. I forgot about triple shot, to be honest. That was the first thing we got. It has not improved. Um, I don't know. Arc shot adds more bullets. I feel like it just makes more sense to do that. Okay, we move on. Like the ultimate fan build. Are you seeing this? Just point and click. feel safe for some reason. Why do I why do I feel that? Okay, I do now with the bulletproof improvement. Fifth shot is increased again. This is actually really good. I'm loving the new difficulty scaling on on the loop. It definitely feels more challenging. It feels like I have to think. A lot of the times you would like build up a, a really good run in the first loop, and then the second loop just kind of feels trivial because you've already built like a really good catered run to destroy everything. But now I have to think, and that's good. Let's go for damage aura. It's kind of troll, but like I just want to see things melt in front of me. It isn't completely troll because obviously with true nightmare, everything regenerates HP. So if you can stop their like their invulnerability or not invulnerability, but their their regen timer. I would say it's pretty useful. Sharp shot. Got elemental here. Just gonna jump back here. Ow. The pumpkins are pre-firing me. I would call this run a success so far. I don't want to jinx it though. Wind up being increased is kind of troll. I don't think it's doing anything at this point. Okay, we get arcane shot up again. We're at like a decent height here. 70% chance. The number of enemies that are spawning is alarming. It's getting worse and worse. This loop is requiring a very strong build. Like it's in it's insanely long even with this build. And I feel very strong. Getting diamond is no joke now. I feel like it I should almost like reset my progress and try again on each gun cuz I feel like some of them are were super gimme. Wind up again. 
like, I guess, demolition? Perfect. Uh, big hearts again. Heal when damaging enemies. I think there's a timer on that. It's not really fantastic. I'll go hard target here just because it's extra resistance to damage. Plus, we're going to heal here a little bit anyway. And we can probably get a heart on this shop. We definitely do all you can eat, level two. Juiced. Split shot? I don't have enough money for that. Dang it. That's insane. Okay, I think we just run this. Kill one of the enemies and now we have just like infinite ammo. The stacks are getting removed so quickly. I absolutely hate it. Ow. I feel like the bosses are taking negative damage. Like actually what's going on? <laughs> what is going on? Okay, maybe not worth it. I'm trying to get like extra stacks by staying closer, but I think we're better just to keep our distance and apply what stacks we can. God, bosses are so strong now on way uh, round two. It's insane. Like, look how much damage we're doing. We're doing like 2,000 damage with the arcane, and it's doing nothing on the HP of the enemies. Ow. Jeez, man, that's insane. Got lightning shot upgrade, that's pretty good. Rocket jumping again, we go bulletproof. Silver heart, we get to 4,000 HP. Only a few levels left. This is insane. I feel like the damage ramping is... I mean, the uh, difficulty scaling has gone insane. <laughs> I don't hate it, but it's, like, very difficult. I guess that's why it's called True Nightmare. Okay, I need to get up here. Thank you. Goodbye, goodbye, and 
What's left? Oh. Whew. Sharp shot. Let's go for health chest again, just because why not? Oh god, get me out. Get me out. I'm just like, I'm just, I'm just biding my time, man. I'm just trying to survive and hopefully not break that rock. But I do want to get the HP from it. Sweet. Oh, that's beautiful. Big hearts. I think I just grab that now. I want to go for the greed, man. I want to do it. I'm doing it. My curiosity is peaked. Because what if I could become even larger? Nice. Sharp shot upgrade is nice. Ah, oh, no, dude. Oh, it's so stupid. I'm not doing it. You can't tell. You can't convince me. Yet. It'd be really dumb. It'd be really funny. But like, I think that that's just like. An at, like a miserable experience waiting to happen. That one nest is like literally one HP. Red Fury, Sharp Shot's just better damage overall. Greed again! Oh, it's taunting me. Okay, let's do it. Be very careful. Having an air battle, uh, anime air battle with this, this crab, man. Ow. Ow. Okay. Big bones. We found it. We're even bigger. We're 20% larger. I don't even feel it, to be honest. 
go for elemental here. Let's get like one more arcane shot. One day I want to like try and get like insane big bones. Like break the game so I'm ginormous. I hate snipers. Have I said that before? Taking bad damage. Die. Like how many stacks of oh my god, dude. <laughs> Okay, hard target's great. They're all taking a lot of damage, so I should be able to like I should be able to survive decently here with like one nope, not doing that. With just one heal here, we should be good. Gonna go for a potent magic. Efficiency. There's a banana. Lightning shot. Big chest is useless. We'll do an arc shot here. Potent magic is probably the play. Let's grab it. Go for a reroll and hopefully find like a cheap. Nope. Nope. I was hoping for like a 25% off like uh, regular armor. But here we go. This is it. Not a great room for the boss. I'm not going to lie. They have so much HP. It's insane. Insane, dude. Hey, uh, King Skull's almost at half. But I'm taking a good chunk of damage, though, as well, so I gotta be a little bit careful. God. Okay. King Skull's dead. I don't know if it's worth it to try and go in for the skull at some point. I probably should because he's, he's the one spitting the fire, I think. So maybe... That does make sense. Am I losing it or how did I get how did I get health back? Oh I got heals from the, the, the King Skull, I think, from his kill like from the kill. Oh my god, I'm getting slapped. Oh, 
Oh, he cleared the, the stacks again, man. Yeah, the one on the left is pretty pretty dead. Get this guy. Die! It's just the one left, man. Kill him, please. Please die. Thank you. Oh my god. That's one more gun left after this one. What a run. It felt strong, but weak at the same time. I don't get it. Once again. I mean, I don't even know why I'm looking at these. I don't care. Look, I'm, I'm done, man. Just get me out of here. Big celebration. Great run. Oh, man. One more to go. Look at this. Seagull, flamethrower, sniper, burst pistol, auto shotgun. Dual shotguns, auto rifle, marksman, arcane, cluster, blade launcher, minigun, rocket launcher, orb launcher, crossbow, and laser cannons. Just these dual pistols left to go. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. What a run. Definitely an interesting fan build. I have no idea what that was, but the uh, arc shop build was great. I think it definitely kept us alive. <laughs> Catch the next one.